this news website you see over here is making over a million dollars every single month you won't believe it let me just copy the url of this particular news website and then i will head over to this website that is called site worth traffic this is where we check the traffic and also the amount any website is earning let me just come over here and then i will be pasting the link of that website here and then i'll hit submit let's check the amount that that particular website is any every single month you can see the website address i've pasted there is any over two million dollars every single month now in this video i will be showing you how you can create your own news website just like the one you are seeing over here using blogger so you are not going to buy domain or hosting you are not going to spend any money at all in creating anything and you don't need any coding idea in order to create this all you have to do is to sit down and watch this video to the end and i'm going to show you every single thing that you need to know now these are the things that we are going to cover in this video i'll be showing you how you can create a menu like this in blogger and also i'll be showing you how you can just post your articles very nicely like this and also i will show you how you can make sure you create your footer menu like this in blogger and also how you can put your logo right here and the logo at the top over here i will show you how you're gonna do all those things in blogger so just stay right here with me and let me take you through and then in case today is the first time you are watching this channel my name is sir francis and what i do over here is it digital marketing blogging and also how to make money online so in case any of this is your interest just go ahead and hit that like button for me and also the subscribe button and make sure you turn the bell notification so that anytime i drop a new video you'll be the first person to watch it so once again have a look at the website that we are about to create using free blogger so this is it right so now let's go ahead and start creating our website right here now to design your website just like this on blogger just go into your browser and then you're gonna type blogger.com so when you type blogger.com it will open like this you don't need to worry if today is your first time you are using blogger you will not be seeing anything over here it's because i have a website already here that is why this thing is showing but let me show you how you can create your own website right from scratch just come over here and then i'm gonna select new blog and then if it is your first time you are using blogger this is the first interface you'll be seeing so you just need to enter the title of your blog over here i'm going to call it gent multimedia for example and then i'll click next and then the address you must enter any address that you like so i'll be entering gent multimedia again in case the address is not available it will tell you that you need to change the letters or the alphabet so gent multimedia is available so this will be your domain gent multimedia.blogspot.com you can change it later when we continue so you don't need to worry just come over here and click save so this is our new website that is being created here i just want us to see how our website is looking so let's come down here and click view blog so this is how our website is looking currently you can see that it's not having any good form over here but don't worry we are going to make everything very nice when we continue so let me take you back to the back end of our website in case you don't know about blogger this is where you're gonna enter your new post this is where you'll be seeing all your posts this is where you'll be checking your statistics and then your comments will be here this is where you'll be checking your earning that is where you'll be linking your adsense account or any other ad network that you want to deal with this is where you'll be creating your page contact us about us disclaimer privacy policy this is where you'll be doing that this is layout and the layout column this is where we'll be doing our customization that is where we'll be setting our site this is team we want when you want to use a blogger team you're gonna click here this is settings and also we have the reading list over here so now let's go ahead and add a team so let's click on team and then there are a lot of blogger teams over here but in this tutorial i'm going to use 
a free template that i've downloaded from one of the websites i'll be leaving the link in description below for you to also go and download you any of your templates that you like so just click over here after you have gotten the template or the theme just click here and then you're gonna show backup restore so just click on restore and then come over here upload and then i'm going to upload that particular team right here so let me just search for it here this is it over here time mark free version so i'll click on it remember we have to upload the sml file only so right here is being installed my own that i'm using here is version 2.0 but when you check the link your own might be different version you don't need to worry because as at the time that i'm doing the video is 2.0 so let's go back and refresh our website and see how it's looking now so right here you can see our website is now having a very good form now let me quickly show you certain things over here when you check the top of the website over here everything here is called a top menu so the top menu is made up of some pages over here as well as some social media icons right here and then when you quickly come down here you can see the logo here i'll be showing you how you can put your own logo here and also all these things that you see over here are pages and also categories so these are the menus that we are going to add to our blogger when we continue right so we have some social plugins over here that is where you'll be adding your social pages and some other items over here in case you don't like any of them i will show you how you can remove them so you don't need to worry so this is how your free templates or team will look now let's go ahead and start doing customization that is start building our website so to start building our website let's go back to the back end of our website that is our blogger dashboard and over here the next thing that we want to start doing is to create a blog post so just click on new blog post and then i have a lot of tutorials on how to write news articles so i don't want to waste time over here i'm just going to move straight to the website that is inspiring us over here that is this particular website and then i'll be making sure that i copy any of the blog posts right here and then i paste them very fast so that we can continue right so i'm going to start with the, the this the first one over here that is the new site and then let me just click over here on this particular blog post and then i'll just copy it very fast so that everything will move very faster so this is the title right here and then i'm gonna paste the title over here so when you want to add your blog post make sure this is where you'll be putting your title right and then the rear article is down here in case you don't know how to write news article check the video in description and watch it after you finish watching this video so this is where you'll be putting your main blog and then you just leave a space and come to the top here and then we are going to add a featured image okay so to add that particular image just make sure the cursor is blinking here and then you're gonna click here insert image and then you click here upload from computer even if you are using mobile phone it's still upload from computer okay and then you choose over here choose file and then simply let's go to where that particular image is so you make sure you go to where the image is, is on your computer so you select your image and then you come over here select so the image will come over here for you very nicely as you are seeing then the next you have to do is to make sure you add this particular post into a category so the categories in blogger is called a label so just come over here and put it under a label now we are going to place this under news i always want to write it in block letters okay but it is not compulsory you can write your own in small letters so after you have done that come over here and click publish and then click confirm so let me go ahead and add another blog post right here so the second blog post that i want to add 
is this one over here so let's just go to the second menu over here that is celeb news and then i want to add this one about stone boy right here i'm just copying pasting the articles right but i have a video over there to guide you on how to write the articles yourself so just to speed up everything in this tutorial so the next thing is to click new post again and then i'm gonna paste the heading right here let me quickly go and copy the main article i don't want to waste your time and then over here to let's add the image that is Tomboy's image just click there and then upload from computer and then choose file and then that particular image is Tomboy so this is it and then select remember we have to add this particular news or entertainment news into another category or label so in this case we want to add it to celeb news that is short form of celebrity so i'll write over here celeb news as we can see on the main website that is inspiring us right so let's come to the main website and see we have celeb news over here and then the last one is pulse so let me just do that celeb news and then you click here publish and then confirm so right now we have gotten two blog posts over here so let's add the next one then we continue with the process so the next one is under sports okay don't worry i'll be showing you how you can add all of them as a heading right here so this is about messi so i'm gonna copy the heading right here let me go back and click new post and then i'll be pasting the heading here and then i'll come here to the down and then i'll select the article after you select the article go back there and paste it and then the next thing we got to do is to bring the image right remember this article is not complete i'm just doing a demonstration to make things very fast for you i have an i have a video on how to write news blog post so make sure you watch it after you finish this it's in description so let's come over here and click upload from computer again and then i'm gonna choose file and then this particular news is about Lionel Messi winning the Ballon d'Or. So this is the image, I think so. And then you're going to click here, select. So the image will appear over here. And remember, this one is under sports. So let's just write sports here. It's under sports, okay? It's under sports. So after you've written sports here, come over here and click publish and then come over here confirm so right now we are done with our blog post remember you will continue to be adding blog posts each and every time for your news website to be updated that will make you get a lot of money okay you'll be writing more trending news but i'm just demonstrating the basis for you for you to continue so right now i'm good with my news article together with the labels over here you can see we have news celeb news sports you can add another category like lifestyle like music like tv shows whatever category you want to add make sure you think about it very well and know that you can write articles in that category before you add them if not it will worry you when you are applying for any ad network approval so right now let's go back to our website and refresh and see how our website is looking so this is how our website is looking after i've refreshed it you can see all the news articles are showing you right here and everything is looking very nice but when you check the header over here we are having some categories over here that we don't want to be on this website so let's go ahead and create our menus and categories right here i told you it's called labels in blogger so let's go back to the dashboard over here and then click on layout 
so when you click on layout it's gonna show like this and let me tell you one thing over here all these things that you see that are having the eye open like this it tells you that they are active and then those that are not having the eye open the eye is being cancelled like this it tells you that they are not open or they are not available on the home page so this is what you need to do whenever you don't want anything right here you have to turn it off that is just to remove it for example when i come over here i don't like some things like this maybe i don't want this subscribe as i don't want facebook i don't want this blogger icon over here this is what i'll be doing you see they are all over here so i can be removing them for example when i come over here you can see subscribe as here just click on it and then you can remove it here so you can see that it's gone then maybe i don't want this one also attribution it's also optional i can just remove it that is a blogger icon over there and then maybe i don't want to report abuse you can just click on it and then you can also remove it okay then make sure you save it after you've done any changes by clicking here okay now when you come to the top over here you can see top navigation over here this is the link list and then what it means that everything that is in this particular column is at the top here the first top menu over here that i've shown you okay so the one that is the header over here is the one that is at this place that is the main menu so that is what you want to create you want to create a menu over here so watch me and see how i'll be doing that so to create a menu simply click on the pencil icon over here at where the main menu is and then you can scroll down here you can see all the menus together with the drop down where you bring this particular sign over here that is this particular dash over here before you write anything it becomes a drop down menu right but in this case i don't need drop down or any other thing i just want to create some simple simple menus so that i can get add approval very easily so i'll just delete this ones so click on the recycle bin over here to delete the old one and then we're gonna create new one so you don't worry so let me just delete this ones but I don't delete the home page okay so the next thing that we want to do is to add our own menu after we've deleted it so click here add a new menu and then it's gonna open down for you like this what is the name of the menu that we want to add the name of the menu is news for example so just write news because you can see the first category we have over here is news right the home page is already over there remember the home page is already over here so the first one that we want to add that is the second over here is the news so let's go and do that so i've pasted so i've written news over here and then at where it's saying site url go to your website and then go to where the news article is make sure you click on news the one you are seeing here so when i click on it i will be going to the header over here i'll be going to the address bar over here to copy this url copy it and then go back and paste it at where it says site url so i'll be pasting it right here remember i've copied news label okay so click here save and then you're gonna click here save to so the next thing you have to do is to come over here and click save so let's go back to our website and then let's refresh and see if in case we get any menu that is being created right here you can see our news label is being created here so whatever people click on the news label is going to take them to all the articles under news where we create more in the future okay so we have to do the same thing for all other categories so the next one we want to do for is celeb news so let's click on it and then let's copy the url okay let's copy the url of that particular label come back to layout remember we are under layout right so let me click on it once again for you to see and then come back to where we did the first one that is the main menu click on the link list and then scroll down to where it's saying add a new menu so click on it now this time around the menu you want to add the name is celeb 
news so you write it over there and then paste the link here remember the link that we've copied paste it here and then save it so let's add all of them before i refresh so let me go back and then the last one over here i think um the last article over here is under sports right it's under sports so let's click here sports and then let's copy the url don't click on the article itself click on the label okay so after i've copied it i'll come over here add new item and then i'll be writing sports here and then i'm going to paste that particular url here then i'll click save so now i've gotten my menus ready here in case you want to make any of them to come first before the other you can just click this arrow over here for example if i click this it means that that one will go down you see uh -huh. when i want it to go back again i'll just click here and then it will come up okay you can change any one of them like that if you want to edit any one of them just click on the pencil icon over here and then if you want to delete any of them click on the recycle bin over here so click save and then make sure you click here to save so now let's refresh our website again and see how everything is looking so right here you can see our menus are ready for us or our labels are ready okay everything is looking now perfectly nice so when people click on news they are going to read the news articles we have on our website so you can see the news articles are showing here when people click on news right the same way when people click on celebrities it's gonna bring the celebrity news and also when people click on sports for example it's gonna bring all the sports news that we have written on our website all right so the next thing i want to show you over here is how you can change your logo right here you can see this particular logo here i'll be showing you how you can change this logo remember the logo there are two one is over here and also one is at a down here when you come to the footer menu you can see another logo over here okay so let's look at how you can change your logo now for you to change your logo let's use canva to create a very new logo very easily okay so let's go over to our browser and then we're gonna type canva over here so canva.com so this is canva.com this is where you can create your logos very easily all you have to do is to come over here to where it's saying custom size make sure you click on that place and then it will display this box for you and what you need to do is to put the width and the height over here now in blogger the logo width is at least 210 and then the height is 48 so put it like that and then what you need to do is to click here create new design so it will open this page for you and what you want to do is to make sure you customize this now when you come to this left hand side you can see there are a lot of logos over here for you to choose any one that you like these logos are for blogger okay so you can just choose any one that you like and customize it but in this case i want to design this from scratch so all i have to do over here is to make sure first i come to this place that says text click on it and then we're gonna add a heading and then i'll be writing in there as gent multimedia you can just write anything that you want okay we are just creating a simple logo right here in order to add to our blogger make sure you drag the side in order to make this very big and then you can also change the font in case you like by just highlighting it like this and then when you come over here to where the font is you can change any font that you like right here okay I don't want to change any font but I just want to show you how you can do that so for example if I want this font I'll just click on it 
and then you can see it has changed right here okay so that is how it is you can make sure you drag the size small small and then you can also go ahead and change the color right from black to any color by just highlighting it first like this and then after you highlight the test just come to the top here test color click on it and then you can just change the test color to maybe red or any other color that you like for example when i click on red you can see that the color has changed to red okay i don't like red i just want the black so let me just leave it like this so what you need to do next is to just come over here and then you're gonna save it by clicking share and then download and then click download again so you can see it has been downloaded to our computer now i want another logo again that the background will now be black and then the text will be white i know why i'm doing that when we get back to the blogger website i'm going to tell you so let's just change this background right here by clicking on the background then i'll come and click background color at the top here and then i want to change the background color to become black and then the text in it over here let me just highlight the text and then i'll click test color and then click white okay so now you can see the background is black and then the text is white let me download that logo also so with the same process i'm able to download the second logo now let's head over back to our blogger and then we are going to put all these logos right here so the first logo that have the white background will be at the top here and then the second logo that have the black background will be at this place that is why i've created two right let's go and put them right here so we'll go back to the dashboard over here and then make sure you click layout it's already there but i want to show you so it will surely open like this and then you're gonna come to the first place that is saying header logo as you are seeing here this is the first thing that we need to do over here so let's click the pencil icon to edit the header logo and then you can see this is the header logo right here okay so let's change it by clicking upload image from computer and then click here choose file it's gonna take you to your computer or your mobile phone in case you are using one and then you're gonna select the logo so this is the first one let me select it So you can see the logo is being updated over here so click save and then just scroll down to this place let's do it at once come to about us as you are seeing here it's also having a logo that is the second logo so click the pencil icon there and then you can see the second logo over here just come over here and repeat the same process by clicking upload image choose file and then select the second logo over here and then there's a caption over there when you go to the website you can see that there's some particular caption here okay this thing i don't need it but in case you need it you can just edit it and write anything there you can write something like get the latest news update or whatever you want to write there okay i don't need this so i'll just clean it and then you're gonna click save and then the next you want to do is to click here save remember to do that that will save all the two logos you have uploaded so now let's go back to our blogger website and then let's refresh it and see how it's looking now so right here you can see everything is looking perfectly well it's now showing our logo over here gent multimedia let's scroll down here you can see gent multimedia here also you can also make sure that you make the logo somehow big in case you want it to be so big okay you just need to make sure you expand it very well in canva that is why you're gonna do that all right 
so you can see the most popular articles are right here and then you can go ahead and add our facebook link in case you want to do that and then the rest of the tags are over here so all you have to do is to make sure that you create more news articles over here and after you create more news articles you can get some field traffic and start monetizing your blogger i'll be showing you how you can monetize blogger over here and make money online so you don't need to worry create the website down and the video will be coming soon in case you want me to drop that video make sure you hit the like button on this video and also go to the comment section over there and tell me how can i monetize this website and i'm going to do that video and show you different ways to monetize your blogger it's not only in adsense or the other ad network that you can use but we can also monetize our blogger with affiliate marketing and selling product right here i'll be showing you how you can do that so go to the comment section let me know in case you are here just go there and ask me how can i monetize this website and then I'm gonna drop that video in, in case I see a lot of people asking me that. Alright, so you can see our website is very nice now. When people click on this, for example, they are going to read the article over there. So when they click on it, you can see the title over here, and then the news article will be added down here. They'll be reading, and then they also get chances to share our blog post on social media okay so everything will look very nicely they can also get a chance to come over here and click any other blog post in case you publish more articles in the same label they'll be displayed over here okay and then they can also come down here and leave their comments and then they can also come down here and read any other blog post that is available so you can see this is very nice now you have to also make sure that you add about us and contact us i will be showing all those things in my next tutorial so let me know in case you want me to be showing that and i will do it for you all right hit the like button for me and also the subscribe button for me make sure you share this video for somebody to also watch see you in the next video